The next time you go train, you're chipping. Try and focus solely on your end position. If you can emulate the chipping end position of pros like Rory McIlroy, you will automatically have a sound technique during impact, backswing and downswing. And it's really a help because it takes your mind away from all the technical issues and allows you to focus more on your feel. Now what are the important chipping end position factors? Number one, you'll see that the pro shaft forms a 90 degree angle with the shoulders. That means that the club head has not taken over the hands. Secondly, you'll see that the upper arms stay connected to the upper body. This helps impact a lot and using the bounce of the club. Then you'll see that the head stays over where the ball was. It doesn't move backwards and doesn't sway forwards. The last important thing is the club face. The club face does not close. Now a lot of pros, as you know, have open club faces at a dress. So in the end position, the club face is way open. There's just no closing of the club. So if you can get your club face in a 45 degree angle in the end position, that's a good sign. So I hope you have a lot of fun the next time you practice your short game. And really, forget everything and just think of target and your end position. Thanks for watching and I look forward to seeing you the next time.